All right. In my other video, in my other video, I showed you how to set up the entire weapon, but the stuff that you did to the .x file wasn't entirely clear. So now I'm just gonna do that. So um, copy Mr. Cleave, and then also, and then paste it, and it'll, it'll make copy of Mr. Cleave, and just call it um, whatever your mesh is final. So I'm gonna make it tube final. So there's tube and there's tube final. Right click on tube and click edit. <coughs> Do the same with tube final. All right, and in tube.x You'll see it has, um, right here it says mesh, and then a bunch of numbers. So click right before the mesh part, and then, um, scroll all the way to the bottom, and at the second end curly brace, hold shift and click, and then copy that. And then over here, find where it says mesh, and click at the beginning of that line. And then scroll all the way to the bottom, or most of the way to the bottom until you see this and click at the end of the fourth curly brace and um, paste your mesh so it should look like this and um, then what you need to do is set up the helper so on this one here, scroll up to the top and you'll see it has the hit point two helper and stuff. So um here. So find hit point two or hit point B. So, there it is. And then um copy these numbers. So if you're all the way out, it should look like that. Just copy those numbers. And then paste it over the numbers in this one. And um, then find hit point one, copy the numbers, and paste it over the numbers for hit point A. Do the same for the AUG ones. So there's AUG1. So copy the numbers. And find AUG01 here. And paste it over the numbers. And do the same for AUG2. So frame AUG2. Copy the numbers. And there's AUG02. So paste it. And if you did everything right, then your new tube should be ready to set up. So go ahead and close it. And then tube final, save that. Close it. And then you can delete your tube mesh. And this is the one that you would import into Fable Explorer.